it's, it's just the little things, isn't it? There's an article out in The Guardian and it lists 100 ways to just slightly improve your life without really trying. So uh, some of these prescriptions for a moderately improved existence include things like bring fruit to work and to bed. I don't know about that. Uh, take up skinny dipping, okay? Uh, bring ice to house parties, okay? So you know, never show up empty handed, right? And don't be weird about how to stack the dishwasher. Oh. Okay, ladies tips, Lane. That's a tough one. That's a tough one. <laughs> the dishwasher one. Yes. Um, yeah. I, I recognize that I, have, I can do this at any time in terms of being able to, but I think a nap makes all yeah. the yeah. difference. That's yeah. a good one. Yeah. It's yeah. free, like, yeah. just take a nap. Yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. It doesn't feel better after I take it. Like, when you take a nap, when you get up, it's like you stole something. Yeah. You know, especially a nap at three o'clock in the afternoon, it is yeah, the yeah. best. You gotta That's time true. that right. Yes. yes. Yeah, gotta time Not it. too long. Yeah. I do a lot of the things on this list that are easy. Like, yeah. I don't have Twitter on my phone. I do take naps. I do go to bed early. Those are easy. But one thing on this list I have just started doing, it's not that easy, but it is good. And it's to be polite to rude strangers. <gasps> and so I recently did this. I was at an LCBO or at, at, at a uh, liquor store, and I I was uh, lining up, and you know how like COVID, there's like a lot of confusing lines. Yeah, yeah. So I stood, and a, a woman, I, I guess I, I jumped the queue, and I didn't mean to. Right. Um, and there was no one also in. The, it wasn't busy, so yeah. just to be clear. And she was so mad at me. <laughs> so excuse me, get to the back of the line. This is where you line up. And I was like, I first felt rage, yeah. and then I tamped it down. I was just like, oh, I'm so sorry. I, you know, COVID rules and whatever. And you could see immediately she felt like a pile of dirt. Yeah. And it was yes. much like that. that and if I had good. escalated, if I had like met her with her attitude, then it would have like, you know, so anyway, yeah. people, it's We could easy. have been reading about you in the paper. <laughs> yeah, we could have. <laughs> then Cynthia Lloyd, you know, I, I have an easy one as well. Um, I, you know, I try to eat as many veggies as possible, but I spend half my life, I feel like cutting vegetables. So I got a <gasps> really cheap veggie chopper that even kids can use with parental uh, supervision, of course. And this veggie chopper, it's so easy. And I literally, oh, look at this. Everyone's like, where do you get this? See, even, even Marquesa can do it. Uh, you buy it on Amazon, and I literally can chop so many veggies for days and, days and days and days. So easy. Is she enjoying that? She, no, she asks it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No, fair question. If she hears the chopper, she's like, drop okay. the peppers, mommy. I'm coming. Oh so my gosh. It's a fun, it's actually a fun it game. It looks like for a her fun thing. Yeah. There were a lot on this list I saw, like planting bulbs in the autumn so that they come up in the spring. Like every day already, I'm like, oh my God, I can't wait to see if the squirrels got them all or not. <laughs> <laughs> and then one of my own was washing your bed sheets on Sunday night or like mm. making sure they're clean. There's something about getting, especially this time of year, into your bed with clean sheets on a Sunday night <laughs> after you share your partner's toothbrush. It's gorgeous. <laughs> You said I love clean sheets, and then I'm like, <laughs> what about the toothbrush? <laughs> yeah, but the irony, perhaps. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> hey there, wasn't that great? Do you know where you can find some equally good content? Our YouTube page. It's filled with discussions, debates, and some laughs. Head there now, like and subscribe.